Hi, this is Eric Rudvig with the IGN Xbox team here to give you your first look at Banjo-Kazooie on the Xbox Live Arcade. It's been 10 years, but the bear and the bird are finally making a comeback. And no, we're not just talking about the Banjo-Kazooie Nuts and Bolts game that's releasing on Xbox 360. There's also an Xbox Live Arcade port of the original Banjo-Kazooie that first released back in 1998 on the Nintendo 64. Banjo-Kazooie is a platformer that followed in the footsteps of Mario 64. The game begins with the evil witch Gruntilda kidnapping Banjo's sister Tootie to steal her beauty. It's up to Banjo the bear and his friend Kazooie, a bird who he carries around on his back, to hunt down the witch and save Tootie before the witch can steal her good looks. But before you can get to her, you're going to have to lead Banjo and Kazooie on a quest to find honeycomb pieces, musical notes, jigsaw puzzle pieces, and more. In fact, this game is really all about collecting things. One of the reasons Banjo-Kazooie became such a hit back in the day was its non-linear level design. You're free to go wherever you want in each of the worlds, collecting whatever you can find on your way, and you'll even unlock levels before you complete the last one. That way, if you find something too tough for your current skill set, you can simply move on, get some new moves, and come back and try it again later. But if you're a fan of Banjo-Kazooie, you probably know all this already. The big question on your mind is probably what's new. In the case of this release, not a whole lot. The game plays exactly the same as it did back in the N64 era. However, a few things have been brought up to date. The game now runs in a full widescreen mode and looks great on an HD TV. Some of the assets have been redone and fixed up a little bit, although some of the textures still retain their old fuzzy look. And of course, the standard Xbox Live Arcade editions have been slapped on top of the original Banjo game. There's now 12 achievements, there's leaderboards where you can track your progress against your friends in the world, and I even found a free gamer pick that unlocked while I was playing the game. The big news though comes with the fabled stop and swap. This is a feature that was supposed to connect Banjo-Kazooie with its sequel Banjo-Tooie, but it never panned out. But now it finally will. Finding certain secret items in Banjo-Kazooie on Xbox Live Arcade will actually unlock things in the full retail release Banjo-Kazooie Nuts and Bolts. Banjo-Kazooie on Xbox Live Arcade is set to release alongside Nuts and Bolts this November. If you pre-order the full retail game, you'll even get a code to download this one for free. If not, it's going to set you back 1,200 Microsoft points. Be sure to check back soon for IGN's full review to see if it's worth it. Thank you.